So Breeze Blend came about, uh, they wanted to have something unique that they could serve their customers and just represent, I think, their mindset and how they run their business and how um, they like to approach both the coffee side and um, I guess the people and the interaction side of what they do. So uh, they selected a blend that's 50-50 uh, of a natural process Ethiopia um, that we get from some friends of ours who import exclusively Ethiopian coffees. They go there and um, have uh, specific relationships where they work with particular mills or um, like estates or farms. Um, so they're there on the ground several times a year. Um, and this is a, so a natural process Ethiopian coffee, very fruity, very like floral and sweet. And then a washed uh, Guatemalan coffee from Huevo Tenango. Um, that's a small little region of Guatemala um, that comes from lots of different small farmers who bring their coffees to a centralized mill where they can bring it there rather than having to go through everything themselves and have all those resources, they bring them to a cooperative or a mill where those things are done for them and they get paid for bringing um, the cherries and stuff there. Um, so they, they selected that coffee and we um, roasted it for them um, to be something that's just generally really sweet, uh, fulfilling, pleasing, and um, can do a lot of different things as a coffee. Um, and then too, so they wanted to tie in something visually, since we do a lot of art with our business, uh, on the bags to really speak to um, what Breathe is about. My process is one of fog, when I will kind of reach into the fog and feel around, this is in my mind, it's going to sound pretentious and I'm sorry if it does, it's just true. Uh, it's um, until something hits me, and so I think in the context of what, a, what will work on a coffee bag, which ours are about 5 by 8 um, and then I'll think about the customer, they'll tell me a little bit about the context for their business, which in this case is Breathe and Hayes, Kansas, and, and sort of the customer base of um, younger college folks and um, older, wiser people as well. And that sort of collaboration, connection, context, where they're sharing cups, sharing tables, sharing space. So um, I had a couple of iterations, and I don't, I don't remember why it's a chessboard, but it's a chessboard. Because I thought about it being sort of collaborative, um, strategic. Uh, so I had, I think, originally a. I had two different animals, and the direction um, it came back was to do the tiger, which is the mascot, and then like maybe a an opposing kind of species of like an older dog. Uh, and so that's kind of what happened. This sort of. Maybe it's a moment of frustration with the younger cat and, and the very patient, wise dog is looking on and saying, I, I've been there, I remember, and guess what, like, there's another game. <laughs>